Hi everyone! Thanks for choosing to watch this video. Sa wakas, natapos ko na rin yung Mastery ni Robert Lee. This book will tell you why are you living a mediocre life. And then, bibigyan ka ng solutions how to live like a master. The January ko pa to sinimulang basahin. Nasa page 108 na ako. Sinabi dito na you will be able to master a thing if you love what you're doing. You are willing to spend most of your waking hours para dito. So, magsuswimming muna kami ng family and I really do hope na makarating muna ako sa next 100 page bago ulit ako mag-update sa inyo. Hi guys! Sabi ko sa iyo noon, syempre lalo na si Sayon. Dito na ako sa 100 page mark ng mastery. Yup! To strengthen the neurons, isusunod ko yung mga thoughts ko about sa nabasa. Siguro most likely summary. Taro ay summary. Very young guys and friends. This book has been so inspiring. Syempre si Robert Greene to, so obviously marami ditong biographies. Naalala ko lang dito yung book ni Angela Duckworth na Grit, Power of Passion and Perseverance. Siguro mas maganda mo nang basahin nyo to kasi naka-detail dito yung magic behind 1,000 hours practice. Tinawag niya yung deliberate practice. Wala namang semantics na sinabi si Robert Greene. Basta, sabi niya lang 10,000 hours. So, ako personally, naintindihan ko pa rin yun as deliberate practice. So, ngayon, sabi pa dito sa book, kailangan mong baghanap ng mentor na magtuturo sa'yo ng mga gagawin mo. Iiwanan mo rin yung mentor mo kasi hindi ka magiging master kung forever kang apprentice. Makes sense, right? Dapat mo rin pagsamahin yung creativity and logic. Mag-isa lang kasi, hindi pwede. It just doesn't work that way. Okay, dumating ako na package. Ang kuto. Attack on Titan. Meron akong bago crush. Sorry, Geralt. <laughs> si Levi Ackerman. Oh my God. <laughs> ano ba yung pakiramdam ng first time magkaroon ng manga? Hindi ko alam kung paano magbasa ng manga. Nabili ko to for 600 pesos. Ito si Levi! Ito si Levi, guys. Grabe. Masaya na ako. Sige na. Natapos ko na yung book! Pero meron pang supplemental contemporary biographies. Suddenly, na-inspire ako magbasa ng mga biographies. Kasi I feel like it demystify yung mga tao na hinahangaan natin. Nakikita mo yung mga struggles nila sa buhay na, alam mo yun, hindi lang sila successful kasi. Yun na agad sila. Naging successful sila dahil rin sa mga choices nila and sa mga problems na dinaanan nila sa buhay nila. So yeah, I think one of the major events and one of the most important things na nangyari sa buhay ko ngayong year na ito, I am able to widen my perspective in life because I am exploring the life of successful people. I thought it's great, pero right now I'm really craving for some milk tea. Lalabas muna ako kasi parang ang haba masyado ng dinasa ko na. So, I really need some refresher. Pero yun, pag-uwi ka natapusin ko na rin yung book.
Tapos karong basa yung libro, wrap up na lang. You want to improve your life. Lahat naman tayo gusto magbago ang buhay, di ba? Don't think mag-rate pa ako ng mga self-help books. I just don't feel like rating it anymore because they're all the best. They're all 5 out of 5 stars. If you want more of me, you can follow me on Instagram and Facebook. I'll link it down below. Thank you so much for watching this video. Please subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you in another video soon. Bye!